Hello everyone, here we are in Old School. It has just launched a few moments ago and we are ready to kick off this grind. I've been thinking about what server series we're gonna start with for the last few weeks. Really like last two months, but I finally decided in this last few days that we are going to do a regular Iron Man here on Old School. I've been doing very restricted, very different series for the last almost two years or so, maybe even a little bit more. Regular Iron Man sounds like a lot of fun to me right now. Just the freedom, we can go and do whatever we want. We can go to the wilderness, we can store stuff in the bank. I just wanna hop around and do whatever content is most fun to me every day right now. I think that'd be the most fun. I think it'd be the most fun for videos at this point in time. Over here, we pick our XP rate. I think I'm gonna do 15X, at least to start. Maybe I'll go down uh, to 5X in the future. But for right now, I think we'll do 15. There's that, and we have to turn into an Iron Man. Standard Iron Man. Confirm. Hell yeah, we're good to go. It begins. Oh yeah, if we do the home tour, we'll get an extra 500k start. Definitely need to do that. Go talk to the Gilnor guide real quick. There it is, guide is completed, and we now have one mil cash. That is very solid to start with. Buy some food real quick, that's another part of the starter guide. Whip a starter weapon, slaughter a cow. Before we do that actually, I wanna head to discovery and enable it real quick, before I forget. Now whatever discovery NPCs we kill at the beginning, these basic beings, we'll have a chance to get the note. It'll be very helpful to get it done now rather than have to come back in the future. Holy moly, the cows are popping right now. Might just go train somewhere else. This is the most efficient way to start off, but not if we have to fight over cows. Voting would be a good place to start too. Now that we have voted, we can claim on this chest right here. There we go. Vote reward, a little bit of cash. Oh yeah, and I'm not going to use this vote book just yet. We get XP bonus with it, and I'm not sure what I want to use it for yet. But we'll figure that out in just a little bit. Before we start any combat or skilling grinds, I'm actually going to do some AFK agility for just a moment. It'll get us some free levels, very easy to do. And this will help us out a lot in the long run. Not going to do this for too long, but I just want to get a few decent starting agility levels. Help us run around everywhere efficiently. Oh yeah, like this fella just said, how do I find Brother Tranquility? I'm glad he just mentioned it and uh, need to go do that real quick. It'll help us a lot in the long run to get it early. We'll farm a whole lot of the affinity tokens and we can use those for a few different helpful things. So let's get that started now. Right over here, just west of the, uh, I don't know what this area is, thieving area, I guess. I remember for a moment. Talk to this fella. Um, what's this about gods? There we go. Hmm. Which one do we want to pick? I don't know what will be most useful. Maybe Bandos. A really important one to have an item for. But we also have Clue Scrolls, and we'll get a lot of items from those, so I don't know. Maybe Zeros for the future. For whenever we do eventually get to next. That's a long time down the road, but eventually we'll be there. And something else I want to mention, too, about the direction of this series, the game plan, the end goal. I don't really have, like, a major focus for this series. I think that's going to be fun, too, just hopping around, doing whatever. I think one major goal for it, though, is getting to endgame raids. Definitely want to be able to do challenge mode chambers, hard mode theater. I'd love to be able to do 500 level TOAs. That's probably my endgame goal for the series. I would love to be able to get there grind out a whole lot of raids, have a whole lot of fun there. That is our focus. I think I have decided I'll just go with Bandos for right now. It'll be the most helpful in the mid game and we'll be there pretty soon, so I'd like to do that. Next is gonna be quite a while down the road, so we can just wait for that. I'm sure we'll have some Zero's Clue Scroll items by then anyway, so that should be okay. 41 agility, that should be good for right now. We got ourselves a cow, fuck yeah. Whenever you get the bones from these cows, you can use them on this little trough over there, and that'll give you a whole bunch of XP to start. Very, very helpful for the starting grinds. 18 defense, just like that. Buying ourselves an Avas, tractor, and accumulator, so we'll be ready. Get a few other useful items right now, too. Iron scimitar, maybe? No, we'll be fine. Adamant probably will need. Some initiate. What else? 
Uh, get some stuff for magic training. Just a little bit of everything right now. Oh yeah, we can buy Barrow's Gloves from here. That's very nice. This lodestone chart is extremely helpful, but we don't need it right this second. You can pick the exact tile you want to spawn on whenever you teleport home. So I'm going to just set it right next to the regen altar. We don't need that yet. Maybe later today or tomorrow. Let's get a starting Slayer task real quick. Maybe it'll be a super easy one. But yeah, not there. Slayer Masters. Uh, yeah, I'll do Turiel first. Well, I don't know. I could try Crystalia, I think. Pretty sure I can reset it if I get something that's not doable. Let's see what we can get. 43 Revenants. Might be able to do that. Probably want to get a few levels first, but after that we can go there. Probably would be better though to start with something a little bit more chill. Then go there when we're a little bit leveled up. Alright, we can cancel it for 30 points or 100k. I think I just want to do that for right now. Wait and get some more levels and then we'll do revs. It's just not as easy of a task as I'd like. Bears or scorpions or something like that would have been great, but... I don't really want to sit in the rev cage just yet. Birds. Okay. First Slayer task on the account is completed. Just some cash from the chest. Let's get another. Going to try Crystalia again. Maybe we can get something really easy. Hellhounds. That is not it. For our real task number two, we get cows. Hell yeah. Damn, we already have two discovery notes. That's nice. Chicken and the cow. About to get a lot of levels from these bones. 18 magic. Oh, come on. Give us... Oh, yeah. There's some prayer. Need some more defense, too. Want to be able to wear these Barrow's Gloves soon. Fuck yeah. 40 defense. Slayer task number two completed. And I think we are just about capped out here. I can't remember if we can just get to level 45... Or if it's 45 combat. I guess we'll find out right now. Ooh, we can get up to level 45 in each stat. That's nice. But I'll move on to the next Slayer task right now. Anything nice from Crystalia this time? Ice Giants. Nope, for the next task, 27 bears. Damn, we got the bear note on the very first kill. That's crazy. We are now 40 base melee. Not bad start. Bear task is done. On to the next one. Fuck yeah, we finally got a doable wilderness task. Chaos Druids. That'll be nice. We can start farming Laren's Keys, Mysterious Emblems. Those will be very helpful for our grinds. These are the rewards for blood money. We'll farm a whole bunch of it over time doing Revenant Slayer tasks. We can even imbue our Slayer Helm and Dag Rings with this Enchanted Scroll right here. There's a Seed Pod, Rune Pouch, a bunch of useful items in here. And we use Mysterious Emblems on this fountain right here. Fountain of Slaughter. Then you can unlock a whole bunch of different perks. There's an Armory. A few miscellaneous items. Tournament Shop is really nice too. A bunch of useful items in here. Blood money, rank bonds, you can even get OSGP. Pretty cool shop. Taking a quick shower, so I'm just AFKing agility for a moment. Already at 47 right now. We'll see what it is when we're back. Shower completed, and we are now 54 agility. Hey, first Laren key on the account. Hell yeah. Key number two. Not bad task. Cleaning the herbs that we get here too, just to get some early herb lore levels. That'll help. Wow, a third key from this task. I'll probably get like 20 or 30 and then go open them all at once. We do need a looting bag too before we go. Ooh, rune kite shield. But yeah, I'd like a looting bag before we go just so that we can store everything in there and have a whole bunch of food on us. I don't know if anybody's going to be there PKing already. Another Slayer task. Ooh, and our first emblem. These emblems will upgrade too every Slayer task that we complete, so it's important to hold on to them. I think they only upgrade to tier 5 right now, pretty sure. Can we get another decent wilderness task? Nope, I'll try one more right now. Nah, not doing that. For the next Turiel task, we get spiders. Spider research notes. Hell yeah. 5 out of 17 now. That's another. Ooh, cancel voucher. These are really useful. Now we should definitely be able to get a doable Crystalia task. Alright, ice giants. Cancel that. Skeletons. Perfect. Already 41 Slayer. That's pretty crazy. Laren key. Key number 2 of this task. That be another. Tier 2 emblem now, a chest. Ooh, looting bag too, fuck yeah. That is really nice. For the next task we get... Skeletons again, hell yeah. Another task. The tier 3 emblem right there. Ooh, ancient emblem too, fuck yeah. From this slayer chest we get... Just cash. For the next task, we get revenants. That's a cancel. Chaos druids again, hell yeah. He and a double rune to H. That's not bad. Five herb lore. We can now clean Marantils. 48 Slayer already. 
Only 10 more levels and then we can hunt the Black Mask. And that's our task complete. Good luck. Oh, I was hoping for another cancel voucher. For the next one we get... Ice Giants. That's a cancel. Scorpions. That's easy. We are 60 strength now, I just realized. So I'm gonna switch over, start training range and mage. Wanna get them caught up. Hey, got the Scorpion research notes on the first kill. Okay. I'm surprised we haven't got any random Mysterious Emblem drops yet. They're not too rare. Slayer's enchantment right there. I don't think it's too useful though. Another task is done and this is our first tier 5 right here. Very nice. Please, another doable. More scorpions. Totally forgot this is a thing, but this person just reminded me. There's daily tasks on here that give you a decent chunk of random XP. We definitely need to do those every day. At least in the early game. Hey, random tier 5. That is fucking sick. 50 range. It's a decent start. Task number 10 completed. How many points was that? Ooh, 125. That's sweet. Baby dragon bones. That's pretty useful too. Not a bad task at all. Two keys, a tier 5. Revenants again. Let's skip it. Maybe get a better one. Lesser demons. Oof. I don't know about that. I want to get some prayer levels real quick, just in case we do get jumped out here. Help us survive and tank our way out of the wilderness. Forty-three prayer. That is huge. We can now use all of the protection prayers. Oh shit, we got somebody on us. Damn. We hella dead right here. No way I'm gonna survive this. GG, man. Oh, fuck. I didn't know our starter bow would disappear for above level 30. That kind of sucks. Everything else is not too bad at all, but that does suck a little bit. Before I keep going with the Slayer grind, I want to get some more cash. And thieving is the skill of the day right now, so we'll get a whole lot of bonus XP here. Let's get it done. Already over 500 total level. Last inventory. This is all the thieving I can bear to do for right now. We did make it to 56 thieving, though. Decent start there. 